Women on dating apps are unreasonably picky. Okay, so if you've been on a dating app for more than five minutes, you've likely figured out that the chicks are unbelievably picky on there. You have to do and say everything 100% perfect, or they will lose interest in you just like that and drop your ass. Everything you say or do, you gotta walk on eggshells around them. They want some sort of happy medium that's impossible to achieve. If you show too much interest in them, they drop you. If you show not enough interest, they'll drop you also. You gotta time everything just right. And if you're off by a microsecond, they stop talking to you out of nowhere and they freaking drop you. And it's fucking annoying. Okay, so the main reason why chicks are so unbelievably picky is because they have literally hundreds of guys per week they are weeding through. So they are looking for any little tiny reason not to date you. Sometimes it's for the stupidest bullshit reasons. Even the timing of your texts. So say you were texting a chick, sending her a text back and forth like every 10 minutes or whatever, and then all of a sudden you get busy because you gotta go to work or whatever and you, ac you actually have a life, right? And you reply to her after two hours. So it went from 10 minutes to two hours. They will notice this like reply window. And that's reason enough right there for them to weed you out and to drop you. So a huge part of online dating is sending pictures to each other. And again, all your pictures have to be 100% freaking perfect. They will judge you on anything and everything. They will always find something to give you shit about. Like say you take a picture of yourself and there's a little tiny smudge in the mirror because you took a selfie. Or a little tiny fingerprint. They will notice this shit. Assume you're some sort of lazy slob who never cleans, and you'll never hear from their asses ever again. It's unreasonable. I mean, I could understand if you sent a chick a picture and you were missing a fucking tooth or some shit, or you were totally dressed up in like homeless bum clothes. I mean, you send them a picture of yourself, and there's a little speck of dust or something in the background, and they get all creeped out by that. It's like, God forbid I don't have time to feather dust my house every freaking day, right? And somehow they find a reason to give you shit for everything you don't have in your picture as well. I mean, say for instance you send them a few pictures of just yourself, and it's just you in all the pictures, they'll be all like, another loner picture? Don't you have any friends? And then they assume you're like some sort of antisocial serial killer or some shit? I swear, you can't make these suckers happy. Oh yeah, one time I sent out this selfie picture to this chick, and my phone was like in the reflection of the mirror, and she was all like, what kind of iPhone is that? And I was like, I don't know, maybe the iPhone 8 or some shit? And she was all like, LOL, time for you to get a new phone. And I, I never heard from the sucker ever again. I mean, yeah, women notice every little freaking detail there is in a picture. So if you send her a picture and you're wearing like a semi-faded shirt, boom, you just lost. It's like you gotta wear a brand new $50 shirt in all your freaking selfies. It's like you gotta wear a fucking tuxedo to please these bitches, right? So to sum this all up, if you send out one bad picture that has the slightest imperfection, send them a text one minute too early or one minute too late, misspell a word on accident because the autocorrect changed a word, look too happy in your pictures, don't look happy enough in your pictures, seem too available to them or not available enough, they will find the stupidest bullshit reason to weed you out of their dating pool. They'll ghost you, and you'll never hear from their asses ever again.